it pulls creamy into the glass. It's got a lovely head on it and it's jet black, just like the Galway night sky. Look at it, black. Lovely head there, little bits of carbonation if you see close, there's bubbles in this one. <laughs> Hello and welcome to your daily fix of a beer with Bob. During the lockdown, we're going to continue to do these beer blogs on a daily basis, just to keep you cheery and informed on the beer scene. Tonight's episode is going to be titled, She Played a Fiddle in an Irish Band. So what are we drinking? We are drinking the Galway Bay Breweries Buried at Sea. It's a milk stout, it's 4.5% in ABV, so medium strength, from the west coast of Ireland overlooking the Atlantic. These guys make some great beers. I was lucky enough to try a few when I was in Dublin last year. They are delicious. The can, look at it, it's got fishes on it, it's orange. It's attractive, it stands out from other cans. You know, on the back, it tells you a little bit about the brewery. So it was established in 2009. They're independently owned and they operate classic styles, you know, from big barrel aged beers to the craft beers that we expect to see from lots of little breweries popping up. So let's open up this rare old Mountain Dew, shall we? Ooh. So it pouring it into the glass it pours creamy into the glass remember people when you're pouring a beer with no head is dead oh look at that oh it pours creamy into the glass it's got a lovely head on it and it's jet black just like the Galway night sky look at it black Lovely head there, little bits of carbonation if you see close, there's bubbles in this one. Let's give it a smell. It smells sweet. Chocolate and coffee perhaps. There is such a sweet milkiness to it. Mmm, roasty and smoky, that's coming from the malts, maybe some hints of licorice. Now, how do you get all that smell from a beer? You know, you just smell it and you see what it tells your head. You know, there's no wrong or right answer. You know, you might smell this and say, licorice, what on earth's you on about? Prunes? I don't even know how they smell. But when you smell it and you start thinking, just try and cast your mind away from where you currently are and you'll start to smell different things. But let's taste it anyway now. Mm. Oh, I do like a milk stout. This is coffee and chocolate. And there's almost a sweet creamy milk at the back of it. Oh, it's nice. It's like a mocha, syrupy perhaps in its texture. There is a warming silkiness to this, to this beer. Oh, it's lovely. I can get treacle from it, molasses perhaps, that's the sweetness there coming through. Oh, it is nice. It's relaxing, almost erotic with how it appears and tastes and feels. It's like listening to Marvin Gaye playing all night long. It's so brilliant to listen to this. You know, you can start drinking this beer in Dublin and then you can end up back in Galway Bay the next day. It's a tremendous beer. Ooh. Oh, you could drink this all day long, swill it around the glass, let's give it a swill. You can see it's almost thick in the glass there as it moves. You know, look at that. Looks like a good cup of coffee there. 
Ooh, a tremendous beer. Let's pour the rest of it into the glass there. Delicious. I got this from Beer 52 in their Taste of Island box this month on the subscription. I would recommend you try and get hold of one of these. It is a great beer. As they sang in the song, let the grasses grow and the waters flow in a free and easy way. But give me enough of that rare old stuff that's made near Galway Bay. Until next time, people. Oh, sorry. The score. Galway Bay Breweries, buried at sea, milk stout, is a 4.5 Bob beer. And until next time, people, stay safe and keep drinking.